hey guys today I'm gonna do a quick video about mirroring your uh, Android device tablet phone to the Chromecast and running XBMC Google just released this feature so it's still a beta feature but it works pretty pretty well and there's a lot of fun stuff to look forward to uh, I'm gonna be making a lot more videos lately I'm sorry I've been just, just been really 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 busy with work I haven't had time and um, thank you to all the subscribers and and thank you all the comments have been great so this is a quick demonstration how it works so here we go there we have a Nexus Nexus 5 and then we got the Chromecast right there so basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna this is how it works in Nexus devices um, on other devices it supports certain devices you might have to use the Chromecast application which you could download from the App Store so let's go here and if you scroll down you see the little button right there with the cast screen button so we're gonna click on that and we're gonna select the there we go and this is connected and now there we go let me walk up closer there you go okay so now what we're gonna do is and sound works and everything works which is nice so we're gonna click on XBMC and there you go it's loading up this is uh see how it's rotating when you rotate the screen and what I what I did notice is if your phone has a 1080p display it will output at full 1080p. If your phone has a 720p display, it's gonna be a little bit cropped. Um, because I tested on my Nexus 4 with a 720p display, it also works. So here we go. So this is XBMC, and you can see uh, and you can see my Nexus right there. There you go. See all mirroring and it's fine glory. So basically, what we're gonna do is. Here's my new Nexus. And the best way to do the, to operate it, you know, unless you want to hold the phone in your hand, but you know, if you're gonna watch something, you'd want to, you know, have the home hold the phone. You want to charge up the phone, you know. So, in my opinion, I just uh, download Yahtzee, configure it, and then, you know, everything works. Let's just let's just um, let's download a quick plugin. See, and this tells you how snappy it is. And I did try with my Nexus 4; runs also very very snappy. The only issue is, let me let me download. Where's the? <laughs> let's do the. Let's do the software. Just for reference, let's go to configure this real fast. Let's go to English. Okay, and it's really snappy. You know, let's go back. Click the home button. This is all using the Yahtzee remote, which is really really nice. Okay, so let's go here. There you go. Let's go to software. Let's go to like the, I don't know, season 16, I guess. Mm -hmm. There you go. What I encountered was, um, as I mentioned, an audio lag. It's about like half a second or so. So, uh, so basically, uh, the best way to, to deal with that was, uh, let's just open up an episode here.
So nothing but pretty girls wearing skin tight clothes and singing songs about their skin. So I'll just go here and turn this down a little bit. Now it's all by the KKK. Just go here. And as you can see, it's very, very nice. So you go to offset and just, you know, offset it by about, you know, 0.5. You know, but, but play around with this. You, your TV could be a little bit different. There you go. And this has been a look on XBMC mirroring from the Chromecast, which is, and this is only a beta one, and it's working, working great. So please leave your comments, subscribe, let me know what other videos are gonna you want to see. Sorry, can't talk today. Um, and thank you all very, very much. Enjoy.